All right, we are here. Turn that down so it doesn't echo. And today, while we are on, I don't have a ton of time, but we are going to go ahead and do grab our dealios here. So let's just go left to right, I guess. Let me uh, switch up parties. One second. All right, there we go. So up here there's one. I'm trying to go off of memory. I think I'll be able to get all these off of memory. But we'll see here. Should be one up here. Jabon. Actually, one of our friends needed a jawbone. So we are going to send him a jawbone because I still think on that one that is something we can still send. Holy cow. My friends list is quite I did not see him going through. No unknown. Come on now. There he is. Where are you? There you are. All right. Now we have one over here. And we're just going to pick these all up. So, um, also, if you guys didn't know, too, the bluegill and what was the other one? Bluegill, oh, let's not spawn there. Bluegill in the ghost pike, and that can be still caught this year, but they don't really benefit you a whole lot. The bluegill will help you on your skeleton challenge, but um, and like I said, like with all these event ones, if you put it on one rod, you can catch it on all of them. Actually, we've talked about that since uh, fighter shark. If you guys remember the fighter shark. That was the way to catch the fighter shark more than one time. You put the one pole in the water and then catch it on bottom rods with the lure in the water. I'm still catching these ghost trout. Oh, that's for, yeah. Nice, Jesse. All right, off to San Joaquin. Oh, or let's... Come on now, let's not be crazy game. <clears throat> All right, so we will pop in here and then the rest of them are from the boat. Somebody broke the leader. That's not good. That is not good. Candle and Let's see if we get any good stuff today. See if we get it or not. Oh, before we go, we got to grab this one that's back here. All right, you can give it to me or no? No, it's okay. I don't want it. Don't give it to me. 
Rusty chain. There we go. All right. So let's. Looks like there's a crazy boat driver. Let's go ahead and grab the one over here. Let's get a lot of them. <laughs> Somebody's watching the video. Worth most money or XP? Uh, probably the demon catfish, just because it's the biggest. But to be honest, and the heron one wasn't bad at all. I'm after item five. Oh, nice, Kevin. Nice. Nice. How's it going, Fabio? I know I just slept for being horrible. I can slaughter names. I cannot be held. I cannot be held accountable for my name slaughtering up that I do. I never said I was a Englishologist. Oh, wrong button. You know how many times I did that while editing that video, guys, where I go show all the locations? It was uh, quite a bit where I'd accidentally pull up my map because it wasn't close enough. So we're going to run down here. <laughs> Good and I'm in your lobby right now. All right, which one are you? Are you, uh, are you Boogie? Wanted costume. Oh, okay. So you are, I'll drive back over there. I think you're the one with the bigger boat. See, when I came in, it looked like you were doing crazy stuff. Yeah, he's back. Here you are. I'm stuck. Change your spawn point. You'll be fine. <laughs> See, I don't think I was wrong about the cold, crazy boat driving. All right, we're gonna get, we gotta get going on to our next lake here. All right, so our next one is gonna be um, a white moose. I want to do that one before I forget because it doesn't have the icon over it. Oh no, no, we're we're just not gonna leave game. Just there we go. I love this game, but there's been some. So how far are you guys on yours, on your uh, Halloween stuff?
This game is running incredibly bad today. There we go. Finally. I'm trying to get the steelheads. Oh, okay. They're not too bad. Just got to look for the charcoal. Uh, are the embers kind of floating up? up? Hey, you had any connection lag? No, it's not. This isn't connection. It's a... So, right now, they switched something on, like, the second... Not this last update, the update before, Jesse. Everybody's getting running screens now, and it's because they've put more of the stuff on the server and less on the client. So, less on your PlayStation 5. So... When we go, we'll go into a randoms rooms today. Uh, when you when you load in, uh, not so much of this part. This is still on your client, obviously, but like you get running screens when you're catching fish now, and that's all from the server now, not from Lager stuff, which is way crazy to me that they would do that because now people with good internet suffer as well. Because uh, if we go fishing today, you guys will see that. On PC took almost a minute to load. Yeah. And my PlayStation and my PS5 is really fast about loading. Gotcha. I've noticed that today. Yeah. Yeah. So a lot, they put more on the servers, which to me doesn't help the issue that was already there. Oh, we got one of the new lures in there. Like, I think I already have enough of them, though. Let's see. Because I, I got some yesterday, too. I got 20. Also, I've heard people ask about this, guys. Here, we'll go to the main map here quick. And I'm gonna I'm gonna show you guys something that isn't worth. It's not as good of a price as you guys think. Uh, <clears throat> so for in 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 this uh, premium thing here. Once it goes, there it goes. This pack right here isn't worth it. No, no, before you start screaming, hang on. So it's nice if you don't have any of the lures, right? But if you have them, it's not worth it because most of, some of these baits, like the dead, eye, the dead mice, the pig's eyes, the candy, Rotten minnows, that's all from last year's stuff, guys. So, unless you have to catch them fish, it's not worth it. Once it, once them, once the guards are done, it's not really worth it. Like, the, for example, the candy, they're not really used in this, this one, you know? Some of these aren't, like the pig's eye, rotten minnows, dead mice, you're really not going to be using them that much. So you're almost... It isn't a terrible deal, but it's about the same just to go buy them, you know, individually. Because you're going to end up with a bunch of extra when you're doing your missions. And if you take the time to go to every lake, you know, if you're higher level, it, it, it definitely is more viable that way, too. Because you've already seen, we've already gotten the newer lures today, so... So for you guys watching, where are you guys all on missions right now? You get any of you guys done too? This one's pretty straightforward. There's just the one right here. We're getting jawbones, which, if the second part of the event allows us to get the other missions uh, back from last year, which I think might be actually what may happen. I don't know, though. I It's like 50-50 but from what I hear. But it honestly could be really nice to go catch some of them Frankenfish again. Them freaking fish were really cool. Let's do 
Let's see these top four, and then we'll save them bottom four. So let's go down there here. You're done? Yeah, yeah. So I did mine, obviously, right away to try to help other people. So here we have two, and then on the other side we have two. I purchased the pack for the carp rod and spot working good so far. I'm at level 53. So that's a really cool one for you, Kevin, because you can start to use spot at a level you probably weren't going to have much, you know what I mean? Um, let's see here. There's one more here, too. Yeah, it's up here. Trying to remember, I'm trying to remember these off of memory. Finished yesterday, thanks to your videos. Now fishing in San Joaquin for Phantom Steelhead just for the cash. Yeah. I'll be honest, these, these Halloween events aren't terrible for cash. I, it's not as good as obviously sitting at Nile. That's why I'm not making videos about it. I don't want them. I'm trying not. I don't want to be clickbaity because I think people people would buy into that too much. Two out of three phantoms getting it done for YouTube. Nice. Sour bread. And there should be one back here. So I wanted to make sure I do this so you guys can see. And we can kind of see how long it actually takes to do this. Because uh, it took me seven hours, but I was walking every part of the lake, guys. <laughs> it took me a long time to make that locations video. I'm sure somebody's going to copy it. Because <laughs> it's a lot of work. Still understand the mixing stuff. Watching your formula videos now. Yeah, if you go back and watch... There's, if you type in the cart mix or oversized fishing, that will help you a long ways, Kevin. And then just take it slow. Like, when you're adding your X to P, make sure you do it in order. Do, you know, your bases first, then your aromas, then your particles. Otherwise, you're not going to get it in. I see a lot of people have that issue. And we're going to go random lobby here. And we're going to try to get all these, too. Took me two real times out, hours to get my third seal phantom. Yeah, see, I got lucky. I didn't have any issues, really. The trout was the biggest issue. But I got them all pretty, pretty quick. I had a lot of luck with mine, I feel. All right, so we're going to run the boat here. Virtual hog, nice. I yeah, like I said, I didn't. I I got super lucky. I didn't. Uh, I didn't have much problems with my missions at all. How's it going, Diggles? I figured they would have hid that one, hid one on this shore, but they didn't. Let's boop onto here. Large liver, you know that. <laughs> getting that, I find that interesting. That large liver is in there, but it is a weird bait. About to catch some Halloween fish. Oh, nice. Yeah, large liver. Yep. So trying to do these all off of memory, and I think I've gotten them all so far. Pig's eye. Firefly larva. A bait coin. So that's the second time I got bait coins. Third time. Oh, and then I just went the wrong way like an idiot. 
One sec seems weird to get large. Yeah. <laughs> One of my friends has played a while. All right, so candy. When is the Halloween Eve? Is it the night of the thirty-first, or is it like Christmas and thirtieth? It's actually the twenty-ninth. So they really, they really didn't get that right. Because if they were doing Halloween Eve, that'd been the night before Halloween. Like Christmas Eve is the twenty-fourth, and I don't know why they did that. It's the twenty-ninth. Is the is what they have it listed as, guys. How's it going, real? Yeah, it's the 29th for the mission. Yeah. So, we'll see, because I don't think it's just that mission. I think there's going to be more other stuff afterward along with it, too. But we'll see. I don't know for sure, so I'm trying not to... I'm not trying to start a commotion, you know? Emerald, I believe there's a few. There's four at Emerald, I think. Halloween Eve, Eve. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> yeah, you got that one out, right? American what? American Xander is what they call it. I'm guessing that's German or Russian. No, that ain't Russian. Oh. Let's see how many times I pop up my map trying to get these today. We'll see. Probably going to be a few of them. While we're here, let's get rid of this dang rain. Oh, yeah. Well, not going to happen. Golden Putzer, Shiner. I'm going to call it Putzer from on now. I like that name. That's better than the name we get for it. Thanks for helping catch a now purge. I bought my, oh, I caught my, oop, I got to watch where I'm driving here. Uh, how's it going, D? And I caught my new biggest 397. Nice. A lot of money in that fish. Can I friend you the game, or do you have to be in the lobby? No, you can friend me in the game. Yeah, you can. Huh? Somebody else is here for these as well. Rusty Chain. The way Rex drives his boat, we'll be able to pull his chain, or we'll have to be able to pull him out when he gets stuck now. Should have enough chain for that. Do any of you guys play any other games besides Fish and Planet? By the way, you guys watch them. You guys play more than Fish and Planet? Because we got events on everything right now. We got, well, big one is Ark. The Ark one is real big. Ark here and there. Yeah, Ark is, uh, believe it or not, Ark is actually my better game. Like, I know a lot of people think I'm really good at Fishing Planet, but I actually am really good at Ark. <clears throat> Ark is life, yeah. What level are you guys on Ark? Call the Wild and Farm Sim. Yep, I knew that one, Kevin. And I think, didn't you do it one time, Mud Runner or Snow Runner, Kevin? I think that you were talking about that, maybe. It's hard to remember. I barely remember what games I play. <laughs> Let's pop in here. 
On Ark, the guys that play Ark, what level you guys are, and do you guys play official? I actually play official. That's the series I have is on official. For a while, and I actually have. Oh no, are you Kevin? Yeah, the uh, I had the window open for a while here, and uh, actually had uh, a fly come in. So, you know, that's a thing. I don't know if you guys get annoyed with flies. Like it could be one fly, and my whole day is wrecked. I haven't played in my while. Peace Lee is slowly dying. I see you. Oh, yeah, Jesse's in here. He's bumpus Bill, guys. I play my own work, nothing special. I don't remember my level. Oh, got you. Yeah, I like it. Uh, it that's definitely, uh, I hate flies. <laughs> nice going. Oh, give me a second. Yeah, don't worry about that, Gogan. My, are the the uh, the uh, Nightbot is quite a butthead, and I always say I'm gonna fix it, and I I never get to it. So I definitely can't get to it anytime soon because the event here. I barely had time to stream today. Like I, you know, I probably. We probably won't stream forever today, but I definitely want to do some stuff. Hopefully. At least get all the the lakes done here. Let's see where let's see where Jesse is. Let's he's over there. Let's uh no pressure, Jesse, but everybody's watching you when you pop up here in a second. Alright. Magic trick, here is Jesse. Wait, wait. Oh, here is Jesse. No pressure, Jesse. <laughs> so if you guys didn't know, that's, uh, that's Grizzly in the chat. That's Grizzly Tabacky. <laughs> All right, off to our next lake. Oh, I got a friend deal. I'll get that in a second here. Is that you wanted? Sam and Jesse get together. You can run but not hide. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, that one guy's been following me lake to lake, I think. <laughs> Rod's staying. Oh, yeah. And when you guys do this, you can unequip your stuff to make it a little bit better. Wanted costume. There we go. I got you on now. And now, let's see here. We did these top four. Now we got to do these bottom four. Yeah, I know. I, listen, after seven years, I know, Fish and Planet, I can't drive my boat at Lone Star. All right? Can we just agree that I don't, we don't need it? Selected room is full. I didn't know I selected a per, uh, I thought I picked random. See if the cat meows. Mission accomplished. Inferno ground bait. All right, while we're here, we're going to grab these as well. All right, what are we getting here? Dead eyes. Huh. So we've had pretty good luck today. We haven't had a lot of crap. Like, not a lot of candy. I ate... Last time I got a lot of candy. Which ground bait? Yeah, I, the backpack is full. That's what happens when you oversize carp, cat. You should go at it. You probably won't be so dang hungry. Bugging me in missions and such. Alright, let's uh, head over to this feline. So I haven't run out of items from last year because I keep getting the ground baits. 
We had a lot of spare ground bait. Actually, I can't forget that one that's over there, guys. Don't let me forget. Fly, get out of here. Also, is it interesting that when the game glitches out and tells you hook three, that's not, that hook doesn't even exist in this game. There is no hook three. Like, it makes me want to get a hook three now just because it's been on my screen for a month and a half. Yeah, so that, I don't get the stuttering, but the running thing now is is from the servers, not your own internet. It used to be when that happened that that was, that was caused by your internet, but now it's not because I've been in rooms with everybody when it happens, and everybody in the room is getting it now. So it's not, uh, it's not, they put more on the servers than they did uh, we were talking about this earlier. Oh, look at there's little flyer, firefly things here too. Interesting. Let me go to the other side of the lake and see if any of them are. Actually, let's go to night and see if them are like real fireflies or not. That looks like California flies. Do we see any fireflies here? Because maybe all the fish have kind of a little. No, I'm not. So, you guys want to get a jump scare? Wait for it. Wait for it. Rex's mother. Hi. Right. I can't even turn that down, guys. So if that's really loud for you guys and you're a headphone user, sorry about that. <laughs> oh. All right, we're done with taxes. Let's go up to Quantum. I So I even for that locations video, guys, I even checked these three lakes and all the lakes that didn't have a thing. And the reason I did is because White Moose has stuff and doesn't have the... Halloween head on it. I'm starting to think, by the way, because in the years past, the, the heads doesn't mean that's part of the event. It means that's where the event fish can be caught, which makes sense because I'm sure there's bluegill skeletons up here. We could test that later if I got time. Quadchkin. I think Rex is sorry too, yeah. What's a good jig head size for the furry beetle larva? I used a 4.0. And that's to make sure I got the size I wanted. 3.0 works too, though. 3.0 to like 6.0. Because there is no 5.0 jig heads. But. Alright, what do we got here? Let's go random room. Let's see if we get some random people in there. So believe it or not, I actually enjoy going in random lobbies and talking to people. It's like one of my favorite things to do. <clears throat> All right, and then these are actually two. A lot of people, I think, are just thinking it's one, but this is actually two right here. All right, and we got this. You know, I haven't even missed any. I haven't needed my own guide yet. I'm editing over an hour of footage for the garden mission. It took so long. Oh, jeez. Yeah, I can tell you that. It takes a while. It, especially, do you edit on, PS, on PC or PS5? Uh, I got a flathead in the heron while spinning a bass jig. It's a slug. Best lure ever. Oh, wow. <laughs> Jeepers. Oh, I went to the wrong one. Pumpkin, you sound like you have something stuck in your throat. 
Oh, you know what? We could, uh, we need to get a screenshot for the stream, too. Yeah, that's a pretty good screenshot right there. Actually, if we come across a better one, I'm gonna make a screenshot and I'll make it make it for the stream thumbnail. Yeah, I know you got caught in your throat, pumpkin, but get her out. You don't want to die now. I mean, you already lost your body, so that's a thing. Oh, I start paying. So the one thing I'm getting a lot of is the dried locusts. And actually, the next chance we get, I want to look and see what them are used for again. Because I actually forgot. Alright, let's pop to... I think... Dried locust, dried, dried locust. Trout bit, huh? We could throw them on. I don't know. Maybe they would. Who knows? Maybe them are actually really good for the the bass and the harn. Phantom bass are wild looking. Yeah, they are pretty cool. So is the blue demon cat in the the blue demon cat is really cool in the the steelhead one. Especially the blue demon cat though. Random worm. The rainbow slug is the first slug at work. You are lying, JC. I have X-Series slugs, and they sit at home. I'm not even lying. When we go back, I'll show you. My X-Series slugs just sit at home. It's the only X-Series gear I don't carry with me. In the game, that's the only X-Series gear I don't carry. Uh, that's, what, three times I've done that now? Four? Dead mice. Does anyone know what the fish looks like? I'm assuming it's the hellfish, right? What fish are you talking about, Bates? Or wanted? How's it going, Monty? Alright, so when we go back, you guys will see that. I don't even carry my slugs with me. This rainbow slug actually did do terrible, to be honest with you. Like, it seems better. The big kuhoo. Oh, I don't know. I have no idea what it looks like. Yeah, they. I don't even know what the other, go the other stuff they haven't added in looks like. But yeah, you guys can see here. I don't even... The rainbow slug is the only slug in here now. I have two X-Series slugs I just don't use. Yeah, the slugs are pretty pitiful in this game. It's like, the two worst things I would say in this game are this and Slop Spoons, but at least Slop Spoons work really good on Perch. You know? Like, if you go to Emerald Lake, Emerald Lake is pretty good for the Slop Spoons. And at uh, Solange, actually, they work pretty good at Solange. So, Monty, how far are you on your mission? Uh, so we got... That's what I'm using at Emerald right now. Ah, it's nice. Caught a big uni snack. Oh, I'm, oh, got you. Oh, done? Yeah, yep. Looks like a lot of people are getting done. It looks like while these missions may have been... So, some people had, you know, would catch other fish with them. None of them have been to the point where they're not finishable. Because if you guys remember, was it last Christmas or the Christmas before, the Gobi one, people just gave up. Like, 
I think I was the only person that I can recall that did the full video on catching all of them. Is there a poor man's alternative for dead eyes? Yeah, put put it only on one pole. Oh, wait, if you're in a mission, you can't do that. You need to have it on. But if you're just catching them to catch them, put it on one pole, put it in the water like we talked about for, like, the fighter shark mission and that. If you're getting dead mice, I don't think this is a dock with it. I think it's the other one. Yeah, it's these other two. I got the steelheads down now. I got to watch your video to go light the fire. Yeah, oh, that's actually a good idea, Wanted, because um, the way I got the sticks and barks, I feel, was a lot faster than what other information was being put out there. Like, I, when I went down to... Uh, when I went down to to do my video for it, I seen people casting at trees. And you don't need to cast at trees for the bark and the sticks. Um, got this one back here. This is a new one, guys. This is the one that changed from last year. There wasn't one here last year. It's the only one that's different on the old lakes. Can you catch the Halloween fish still if you have completed? Yes. Yep. Yep. So... We're probably going to do that here in a little bit once I get done with these. we got a couple lakes left. And then we'll just pop around real quick. Are you kidding me in the trees? Yeah, people, well, because it was bark and branches, people thought they had to hook trees. When in reality, when you go to a lake and you hook a lily pad, you can get anything from that lily pad that's available at that lake. You're just, you just got to get lucky, you know. So, like, uh, where is it? Uh, weeping willows. There's a lot at weeping, so let's get them done. So weep. If you guys didn't know, if you guys are going for these two, <coughs> weeping in Michigan have the most. They both have six each. So we'll start here. We'll do the straightforward one. You got. I'm done with seven missions. Oh, nice. Got you. Even frogs, I guess. Yeah. I stuck, I got my sticks in for branches at Mudwater. Yeah, you could do it there too. And the Haran. I almost put Mudwater and the Haran in the video as well. How's it going, Karna? Karna, I think I pronounced that right. Again, disclaimer, I'm not e uh I'm not an Englishologist. So if I don't pronounce stuff wrong right Nobody can get mad at me. There, I said it. All right, so there's six here. That's one out of the way. And then we're going to go... Um, we can go... Where was it? Right here. We're going to go get this one. 32 watch and 12... <laughs> Monty. <laughs> you guys have great... Just stopping by to say hi. Oh, okay. Thanks, Micah. <laughs> yeah, I know it sounds crazy. I'm not, uh, even though I'm on YouTube, I'm not, I believe it or not, I'm not as worried about the, that type of stuff as a lot of people are. Oh, look, that was a new bait or a new, the new lure deal. Yo. How many of them do we got now? Um, 50. <laughs> Oh, man. 50, huh? We have 70 of the rainbow slugs. Ugh. All right, we go back to here, and this time we go to the right to the bench. How many total pumpkins and tombstones at UK? There's six that I am aware of. I couldn't find any more, and I spent a lot of time here. 
Uh, the I did miss one in the video, and we're going to show it today for you guys that uh, are here. You guys are going to see it. I did miss one, but when you see where it is, you'll know why. All right. There's that one, and then we got this one. I have zero rainbow slugs. I wish I could give them away, Jesse. I got 70 of them. And then this one right here. Jawbone. We're getting a good selection today. Like, uh, I feel like this is not a bad run on grabbing stuff here. We've had pretty good luck. It's not real bad, not real good either. I think we've gotten one of everything, almost. Almost. I don't think we got it. Did we get rainbow slugs yet today, guys? I might have got rainbow slugs, actually, now that I think about it. I don't think I got any health frogs yet. I don't think I've gotten health frogs or candy today on this run. By the way... Sander Banger Sea Lake, when you have to walk it, is insane. I, I'm getting a lot of slugs. Okay, got your fork, yeah. So we'll go to Lesney, pick up the three at Lesney. I'm I'm going to be pretty impressed. We're gonna, I'm going to do all these off of memory. I don't even... I'm watching... I got the stream up on my phone. I can't even watch my own guide for this, so I'm pretty happy with this. I'd be streaming the ARC event, too, because I know a lot of you guys like the ARC event, but the issue with it is the game crashes all the time, and that cuts the stream off. Also, I, I hope I'm not missing anybody talking to me in chat. Thanks for being loud, pumpkin. Dude, you just got to clear your throats, guys. I feel like that might be a better screenshot. Yeah, that's not too bad. Uh, where did I go here? We gotta go this way. So, you can actually get three bait coins out of these, too. So, you can get one, like, two or three. Hairball. I I have gotten a lot of hairballs, I will say that. I got thirteen out of you to, to yesterday. Oh wow. Thirteen bay coins? Oh I didn't know that. That's good info, guys. Well, now I'm kind of thinking I'm kind of bummed. I haven't got 13 yet. The only video I got up fast, Fishing Plan update, was Tame and Con. I got that up first or second on YouTube. Other than that, I'm slacking a bit. Yeah. Yeah, see, the, the monster fish ones, the monster fish ones, I normally like the first person to catch them on PlayStation because I'm on at that time when they come. Me too, only once. Oh, I didn't know that, guys. That's really good. I got You got one so far, Jim? Don't worry about Nightbot, Jim. Nightbot's a butthead. You can get skeleton bluegill at Tiber worth one dollar each. <laughs> Listen, we we ain't got that type of big bucks, guys. We need a one dollar fish.
All right, so we have this one up. Wait, we have this one over here, and then there's one over there that wasn't in the video, guys. And I'm gonna take you over there to show you, but clearly. I am not Jesus. I cannot walk on this water. So we are going to have to take a boat over yonder. And it's not the one from the mission either, believe it or not. Dried frog legs. And then up to boat dock. Quit hawking loogies, pumpkins. Large lever. Hope you guys are ready for a boat ride. The durability is so... Also, by the way, this is a long lake to fit or walk to, by the way. I walked this whole darn thing. Or what you can walk. Uh, I'm just... Oh, got you. Um, durability is bad, but I'm not going to like... Oh, I have no idea what Gogan is. In real life. If the next part says the 29th, does the day end the day after Halloween? Yeah, I don't know how that works. What what What's the date today, guys? Is it... It's the 21st, so we have 10 days. Oh, wow, yeah. 14 days. Yeah, so that won't give you many days after this Halloween Eve thing. Yeah. That is interesting. I didn't even think about that. They should have put the second half of it on like the 25th or something to balance it out. Also, how do you guys like my ninja boat driving skills? Pretty good. Wait, you got... Yeah, we got bait cards from a thing. Go Gan, it's a fishing clan per se. Oh. Didn't know that. So when you see this bridge here, guys, or the the thingy doodler of thingy doodler justice. Oh, okay, we're just gonna I just that was one step, guys. I must have the tallest guy in the world. And use our ninja skills. We gotta go over this way yet. It is right here. That's just, this one's a hidden one right there. Hellfrog. Okay, so we did get everything. I think that was the last thing we hadn't got, right? I think we literally just got everything but candy on this run. Now I wish I had saved all these, cause uh, then I could have showed. Hey guys, be patient. You can get, you can and will get everything from there. <clears throat> Real quick, I had heard somebody say there was up by the bridge. And we're going to go check because, not that I don't believe people, but some people aren't always honest or check. We're, we're not going to do that drive. We're going to do this. And we're going to walk. I don't think there's one back here because I walked here. We'll be careful. We'll check. Yeah. But uh, I don't think there's one here. And we'll do it at night, in fact, too. Yeah, I know it'll cost me a bait coin. We'll do it at night. We can really see the glow. Make sure I got this right. But somebody said there was one up here. In Not that I don't trust people, but I like to make sure what information I give out is real. Um, and I test it myself. So if you guys see one up here, let me know. I didn't know you were live. I've never watched your streams. So thanks for telling me you're streaming because it was a great decision to watch this. It is never a great decision to watch me. I mean, maybe for guides, but for entertainment value, I don't know, man. You kind of got that. I'm funny like a lead balloon floats. That's kind of how I go to it. I'm good at... Oh, I guys, I didn't even realize they were in chat. Never, but I always do. <laughs> yeah, Kevin, you're 
that's the reason your moderator is you're here a lot and you're even. Like, I don't ever have to worry about you saying, oh, the game's trying to kill me or other crazy stuff. Anyone got the cart baits from the tombstone? The cart baits. What ones were them? Oh, yo, I don't know if I have yet. Wait, maybe. Let me look. Carp, carp. Yeah, we have. Yeah, we have. Yep. I've got, I got these from it. I haven't got, I don't think I got sentry eggs today, but I think if you go back and watch the video, I got chopped fingers yesterday in, in the, or when I did the locations video. So that is another one we didn't get. We didn't get sentry eggs today. Yeah, everything else it looks like we've gotten. How frogs we got. Yeah, and I have gotten clam shells. You see, I got more of them from my video. It'd be really easy to tell. If I go back and look at my videos, I can go tell how much, you know what I mean? Like, I got some more. I have not gotten Infernal Crab, though, from it. That is the only Infernal Crab I've gotten, guys. All right, let's make sure we're looking for pumpkins and tombstones. Because somebody said there was one right before the bridge up here. But I'm going to check everywhere again just to make sure. But I don't think there is. I could be wrong, but like I said, I walked around these maps for like seven hours when I made the locations video. I did miss the one at Tiber, though. So, I mean, it's possible. I'm not seeing one, guys. Did you guys see one? Okay. Maybe he bent on, maybe they bent on the other side. For a second, I really did think that buoy was actually a pumpkin. I'm like, oh, it's like glowing, though. Sorry, guys. I am not good at doing multiple things at once. That was the hardest thing for me about YouTube, is you don't realize you have to do stuff. And talk at the same time, which is not as easy as it sounds. I mean, it's easy to talk and do something, but you have to, in order to be relatively okay at both, it isn't as easy as it sounds. I'm, yeah, I'm not seeing anything here. Uh, just to make sure we're, I'm really checking though, I'm going to look just a little bit down this deal here. Make sure it wasn't this side that person was talking about. <laughs> He's right, guys. You either trip your words or you mess up your gameplay. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's not so bad in a guide because you kind of know what you're doing. But when you're doing it in a Let's Play, like... The like the farm for you guys like Kevin. I know you, Kevin watches the farm series. Sometimes I stumble on my words in that one. In that one, it becomes it, it takes practice. It's something I'm still getting better at. I've made over three thousand. I think I made like three thousand videos, or getting close to it total now. And it's something I'm I'm still just getting used to. Guys, I don't. Did we miss one? Because I didn't see it. If there is one here, I have not seen it. And uh, this is why I check everything myself. Not that I don't trust people, but you really need to... You really need to check everything. In, in, especially in Fishing Planet. Uh, I don't know how to say this without it sounding negative. Because I'm not trying to. But there's... You have a carryover of fishing real fishermen to this game 
and they have the tendency to be real fishermen in real life, if you guys know. Not everybody, but there's a larger portion of fishermen that are very, like, secretive and know-it-all and and uh, deceiving, and it's weird. Like, and if you don't believe me, look at any picture fish you've ever seen a fisherman catch. They have their arms stretched out, and they make it look like it's not stretched out. And ask them where they caught that fish. Most times they won't tell you. Facts. <laughs> Sometimes it is really funny. He looks at an item but calls it something else. Yeah. What did I do that the other day? I did it the other day on something, too. I actually did do that just the other day. Yeah, I'm not seeing this, guys. I, I'm pretty sure I got all of them at Tiber. Or at least I'm 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 pretty safely sure. Alright, so that was the last of our thingy doodlers. Oh, and I'm dropping my phone here. Trying to make sure I'm not missing chat. They will tell you I caught it in the water in the mouth. Yeah, Jesse, you know, because you fish in real life quite a bit. When does your the gar cup start? That starts next Tuesday. How's it going, Eric? All the cheating scandals in real life are wild. Yeah, did you guys hear about the walleye one? The walleye one was nuts. Some guys over their career made over $3 million. Actually, Jesse's the one I think that told me about that. Nutsores. So, real quick, uh, what polls do I have on me? Let's throw on. Um, let's throw on Phoenix as quick. I just want to make sure the old ones can be caught here. Phoenix. Phoenix. And uh, Phoenix. All right, so we're going to go to Lone Star here, guys. No candy in here. I don't think I have the candy in here. No. Those wild cheese are lucky they didn't get strung up. No kidding, man. Normally, I'm not against like that type of stuff, like that mob type mentality. But them are the guys they've been stealing money from. Up to item five, nice, Eric. They seized their boat and got arrested. I didn't even know that yet. I'm finally catching you live. Also, finally raining in Seattle. Boy, I that's got to be the first time that's ever been said in a sentence, Steve. Finally raining in Seattle. <laughs> said no one. <laughs> All right, so let's go. I moved from Central California, brought the freaking weather pattern with me. Nice. Yeah, I never did ask you, Steve, how did that move go? By the way, for the people that don't know about the walleye thing, there's a walleye comp, and people had stuffed walleye fillets, two guys had stuffed walleye fillets and eight pounds of lead weights. So three kilograms, just over three kilograms of lead weight into fish. It ain't even need it. They had won it without it. How's it going, Viper? Uh, so we're going to try to catch the bluegill dealios and we're going to try the thing that we talked about way back in the fighter shark video. We're going to make sure, uh, this still works. I'm assuming it will, but we'll, we'll double check. Let's put, uh, 
candy on. And then we'll put something else on the others. We'll put candy on two. We'll put candy on two. And then we'll put uh, blood worms on, on these two. It was nice, but basically part of that move... Oh, part one of the move. Temporary stay at my daughter in law's place, but she'd either have a rental or a home in her own next six to eight weeks. Oh, that's good to hear. You know, actually, it's probably nice to get some time with your daughter in law, too. <clears throat> uh, having, if you lived in California and they'd been in Seattle that whole time, you probably hadn't seen a whole lot of them, you know. So let's go over to Lone Star. And we'll check and see if the bluegills could be caught. Honestly, Michigan's really the place to go, but now I'm worried with Michigan that uh, that demon catfish will do it. Appreciate your videos. Thanks, Eric. Hour of editing down. Do you use Share Factory too? Yeah, I do. Yep, yep, yep. I have a bunch of stuff set up and templates and stuff. One time I'll stream me editing a video, guys, because I think... I've done it before. If you go on the channel, there's, I streamed it once before how I make videos. When I make a fishing planet guide, a lot of times it really only takes me about 15 minutes after I've recorded it. Like when I get the footage, it only takes about 15 minutes, but some of the other ones, like when I used to edit on PC, if you guys sort my videos by list and you go back to, uh, the oldest. So there's like some, GTA 5 heist ones from when heist came out. That was the day heist came out. Each one of them videos took about 20 hours to edit, even though they're not that good of a video. Expecting her first baby in January, so she's loving her mom here with her too. She just can't stay too long. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Let's go on party razor. Catch the bluegills at Tiber. It's easy there. Yeah, I'm thinking it's pretty easy at most of them. Hey, this is Golgan. My iPad died, so I switch to my phone. Oh, I'm, oh, got you, got you. My actual YouTube account. Now, Heron is a good place to nail trophy copies. Yeah, and unique copies. How's it going, Max? All right, so let's get poles in the water. Um, I'll be honest, guys. I'd only um, originally planned to stream like 45 minutes. And you guys have been so much fun. I'm doing, uh, I'm actually going to stay on a little longer here. Forktail. Do you do any guy, comp guides for Congo and Solange? No, and it's not the reason, not that I wouldn't want to. It's the fact that, you know what, we could even we could even try it at night just to be fun. We'll do it in the late night, the early morn. Um, I just don't have no interest in comps anymore. I know it sounds crazy to you guys, but... I got to the top 50 in comps, and I just, that was a personal goal. So I had some goals, guys. I think I've talked to it. So some of you guys like Kevin or Jesse have been around the stream for a while. I wanted to do, to make sure when I was started making videos, I made them to check for myself, right? And it was because I didn't have marks to go back and look at where my spots were. So I made videos to go back and and remember my own spots well it turns out other people kind of liked them so i started doing uh doing a lot of guides well when i got part way into them i was like well i want to make sure i'm actually decent at this game so i went and for a couple months i did comps i got up into the top 50 that was my goal i wanted to get to the, actually the the top 100. I didn't care about top 50. I just happened to get in top 50. Then I had another goal to do two finals in tournaments last year. I actually made it to like seven. 
and we're in like seven in a row this year. And, and so that's part of it. Do you have any, uh, I have PTSD because I'm off service at Slanch. See, I didn't have that much problem with that one, Monty. Right here. Um, do you, did you do oversized? No, the, so the carps, I, they haven't been able to be caught yet. So there they are right there, guys. The bluegills are still here. And I'm assuming you can still catch them on other stuff if you wanted. Let me grab this one and see. This seems like something decent, like a trophy bluegill or crappie. Trophy crappie, I wasn't wrong. This spot here, by the way, if you guys are doing little fish at Texas, this is a spot that always win them custom cops at. <laughs> You just rip them out of here. Also, if somebody talks me down in this chat here, guys, you guys got to tell me. I'm terrible at looking at it, and I'm not ignoring people. We'll throw this one out first. Thanks for helping. Nice, D. Th yeah, thanks for watching. What is XP, best XP fish in Bolivia? Red tail and, yeah, red tail and, red tail and uh, gilded. They're really where it's at. Trahara, or, uh, Trahara aren't bad either, but you can catch the gilded and the, um, the, the gilded and the other one quicker. I gave up on it. Oh, got you. Yeah, I didn't have much of a bad luck with it. I don't think I'm holding my head the wrong way. I don't think I'm holding my head the wrong way. Not sure what you... Not sure you mean on that one. Oh, okay, this... No, this, every pole go off at the same time. That freaking works. Green sunfish. This would probably be a skeleton or a shiner. Shiner. And I have no idea what this is, but it's annoying. So get out of the water! Golden shiner. So for you guys too watching, I think, oh, the right way. Okay, got you. For you guys watching too, so Fridays we normally do the catch them all thing. We'll we'll be back doing that next week, by the way. As far as I know, I'll be doing it next week. All right, so let's go. All right, let's finish this up by going one more place and testing. What did we have last year for fish again? Um, oh, it was gars, and we've already caught gars. Let's go see. I've seen people catch a ghost pike. Let's go see if we can catch a ghost pike quick. I, well, I know they can be caught, but... Uh, I don't remember what lure we used for them last year. I should just check my videos. All right, let's go to back to home. Is the hellfish a carp? No, or, or uh, I don't know what the hellfish, what one. There's a few of them. <clears throat> and there is a demon catfish. But the carp, I don't think it'll be out till 29th. Spider on the jig head works for the pike. Oh, got you. Okay. We'll probably try a few things here. Let's go here. First of all, let's, let's re-template this.
Let's do the Nile Chaser with the Titanium Leader. And then, just for poops and giggles, let's throw this away here. And I actually think we're going to go to St. Croix quick. And then... We'll go Random Lobby. And we'll just do a tiny bit of fishing. So what are you guys all doing right now? What's everybody up to? Yeah, see, there's a ghost park right there, guys. All right, so we're going to... You know, I think it was actually the spider spoon, but... We're going to see if we can catch it on a normal lure since we know it comes out. I think it was actually a spider spoon that it was caught in, pretending to work, Jim. Out of nowhere, Jim Jim was lurking. I'm at Quanchkin, oh, Quanchkin Vampire Gar. The Vampire Gar are fun. They are so much fun. Last year, we actually did a full stream just dedicated to having fun with Vampire Gar. See, this right here, guys, is what I'm talking about. This running screen, everybody on the server just got that. Having lunch here, leftover ribeye steak and apple slices. Oh, that sounds good. I'm hungry. I didn't eat yet today. Oh, yeah, the smallies were the slowest for me. The, the larges came out super well, but... Not a great day here. I mean, you can still catch them. I, uh, I like the sunny day. We'll just we'll go with this cloudy poop day. Boss is gone and it's Friday. Oh, nice. What do you do for a living, Jim? Trying to catch a trophy chain at Emerald. Not as easy as they used to be. Uh. In between the two docks at Emerald, there it's better there. Are you talking about the trophy? Oh, okay, so if you go on the boat dock with a casting spoon and you cast all the way to the left side lily pads, the ones that are past the left dock, way out there you shouldn't have much problem with it. Actually, we'll, we'll fish a tiny bit here, and then I'll go show you what I'm talking about because we'll, we can catch the trophy chain really quick. Just got it. Oh, got it. Yeah, as I say, otherwise I could go up there really quick and show you. First of all, let's go up here. All right, right here. And then we'll go down to speed two. Do you ever get burnt out of fishing planet? Like, do you ever feel like quitting the game? So, believe it or not, I've had the opposite feel. Uh, the more I play it, the more I like it. I don't always have the time to play it as much as I want. Um, but definitely the other way around. In fact, I had thought about restarting to see if I could restart a character, but once I found out you couldn't do that, I, de I decided against it. The skeletons and ghost pike are at the same same chords, just that thought, yeah. I'm just seeing if what we could get on a normal spinner, Let's see? Because I know the uni pike would come out normally pretty quick on this. Do I do YouTube full time? Uh... Yes and no. Yes, time-wise, but not pay-wise. I don't make much money on it. I do it for fun. In real life, I own a hauling company. Um, I haul stuff for a living. But since COVID, I've basically not done that a whole lot. Ghostbuster 2, yeah, I think that's the one that gives you the Fire Phoenix. 
I have all them done from last year. Why don't you start a new game on PC? Because I am not allowed to. Unlike you guys can start multiple platforms. Because I do custom sponsor comps, they ask me not to do multiple platforms. That was in the email I got it. In fact, it even popped up again for me when I did the Discord thing. That's cool. Yeah, so people think this is the way to go or to make money. So you guys know what videos I put out, what views I got. And completely honest, I think in six years of doing this, I've only made around $6,500. And I have a lot of hours in the video. So that's like $2 a video, guys, if you're wondering. Now, obviously, they're getting better now. And uh, I didn't put ads on my videos for a long time. I should pay attention to fishing because I'm really sucking this up. Just got a 28-pound ghost pike. Nice. It, the problem, the thing is, people people do YouTube a lot because they think they're gonna make a lot of money, and and that's not what you should be doing. It you should be doing it for fun, guys. If you, if you it's something you're doing, this is a uni, I think here. Yeah, this is a decent one. There we go, thirty six. That's not too shabby. If a person's trying to do stuff for money, Twitch is a lot better. So, like, when people donate to me on YouTube, I think I've had two donations now since I've turned it on. I turned donations on about a week ago. And YouTube, I think, takes just over half of it. Twitch, actually, I think only takes a third of it of theirs. It, and there's a lot more ad revenue and stuff. Right now, money making Twitch is better at, but I just don't feel like as a live platform. I I just I used to do Twitch years and years ago when it was unpopular, and for me, I don't feel like I'm as good live as I am being able to edit and filter myself because I'm a moron sometimes. Yeah, views also depend. Yeah, definitely. I want to get my hands on the other demon fish. Yeah. So, one second, Colin, I'll take you over there. Just caught a 95-pound alligator guard. Nice. Not bad. That's why them are fun. Uh, when you're going for the regular guards, you'll catch a lot uh, of regular guards. Actually, so... In that video that where I did it, I caught a 91 and a 97 as well. We're all morons sometimes. Yeah. <laughs> True. But generally when I'm a moron, people, people call me out on it. <laughs> Which I'm okay with. It doesn't bother me. Yeah, this day is just, I know it sounds crazy, but this day, this spot in particular is really rough. Now, if I go, give me a second here, we're going to go, we're going to go over here, and this spot will be a little bit better. Alright, out of the boat. My crew. Your current guard is 100. I think that's what mine is actually, too. I'd have to look. Yeah, 100.7. Alright. So this spot, though, is pretty decent on this day. I gotta go. Thanks. It was fun. Yeah, have a good one, fisherman. 
So this bot isn't generally too bad on this day, but we might get something to bite here. The cloudy day is just not very good at Michigan. I mean, you still catch everything, and you'll get uniques and stuff, but it's not like when I do the sunny day. When I do the sunny day, it's much better. And if you guys ever listen to me on Fishing Planet, <laughs> my strongest things are here in Alaska for sure. And actually, oversized fishing was used to be one of my worst things, and now it's actually one of my best things. Like, if you guys didn't know, we had 11 people use the Super Viagra in the Carp Finals. So 11 of the top 12 or 20 people on PlayStation we're using that Viagra mix that I made, which is really cool. And nine of us, nine of us were close friends. Like the group that you guys see normally was streams. That was nine of us in the finals, and it should have been ten, but Pal lost his internet. So, I'm mostly interested in a demon tarpon and a demon sturgeon, but all, yeah. Colin, exactly the same. Now, I want to... I'm actually... Oh, that was a good hit right there. Dang. I wish she would have took. That was a big one. I'm really interested because I've enjoyed this event so far. There's a little pike. A little musky. Tiger musky. We'll do a couple more casts here. Just completely did every single step and wait for the 29th. Yeah, same here. Yep, yeah, it's waiting like everybody else is. I was going to make guides on the skeletal fish and the ghost pike, but I did it last year, and they're still completely relevant. They're the same as what they are last year. First day of the event. All right. Yeah, yep. Yeah. The first day of the event was busy for me because I did all the missions and, like, I think... You I think we did 18 videos total on the first day. Best part of the oversized carp and so many from your group getting through is you get to ride Rex's butt for a while. Yeah, hell yeah. We get to, Rex didn't even want to do the carp tournament, and he wins it. He wasn't even going to do it, and then he won it. Trust, we give him shit about it, trust me. We'll do a couple casts here, and then we'll have to call it. I hate to do it with 40 people watching, and it's been fun. In fact, if I didn't have animals out on Ark, I'd probably stream another few hours. They should have made it where you can buy bait coins for like one or two. Yeah, I see that, but since the now perch came out, that would be so ridiculous. And if you do all your missions and stuff, honestly, you have quite a bit of bait coins. Like, uh, I think I even have, even after this this event, even buying stuff for the videos and whatnot, I think I have. I still think I have like four or five hundred. Yeah, four hundred. And I have all, like, basically every license in the game that I know of. So... Not a whole lot of uses for bait coins anymore for me. So when the event comes out, I that's what I kind of use them on. And then if you do decent in tournaments, you get a, a lot of bait coins. A lot. I've wasted more bait coins than I've... I used to buy poles that were bait coin poles just to have the SC versions. Because at one time, some of them had better durability. So... At twelve fifty five and he's in the yeah. Alright, 
make sure nobody was talking to me in this chat. I feel so bad when people say hi and I don't see it. Let's, uh, oh, not equip that. Let's run back. Oh, you know what? And the blade spinner, guys. I think that was from last year, wasn't it? Yeah, I think I, I think you could use them on the guards as well. But you're right. I'm totally interested in the demon tar. I'm, I'm interested in all of them. But the demon sturgeon and tarpon seem pretty cool. Also, the, the muskies. I'm, I'm kind of interested in all of them. Even the carps kind of sound cool, but. I just hoping they're not reskinned. Like I hope they have some cool textures to them, like the the catfish demon. So, for you guys watching, I'm gonna end it here. Uh, but you guys been awesome fishing with you guys today, hanging out. And remember, every Friday about this time we're gonna be doing this. So, if you guys want to come hang out. You're more than welcome to you guys. It's been a lot of fun. I don't do much Monty. I just like doing the game. Anyway, guys, I'm off. Have a good one. I got animals to go feed on Ark on that event. Have a good one, folks.